Hi there, this is Dominic Dejan Craig, and today we are going to be talking about the latest version of the Russia lie, the Russian bounty lie. The lie, the latest version of the Russia did it lie, is that the Russians were financially reimbursing the Taliban for killing American soldiers in Afghanistan. Now, this lie is pretty amazing, I'll tell you what, man. It's completely insulated. They know you can't ask the Russians. They know you can't ask the Taliban. And they know you're not flying to Afghanistan or Russia. There's absolutely no way that you could check. Now, <clears throat> the Russia lie, I mean, it's been around for a while, man. I mean, no matter how much it gets debunked, man, it's like Santa Claus, man. It just won't go away, like... Yeah, uh, it's, uh, it's amazing. Um, Democrats truly believe that Russia stole the election for Trump. Um, I don't even know how you steal an election, but they say, Oh, no, no, Facebook, Facebook. And come on, man, we're on Facebook right now. Many of us have been on this platform together for years. And we know Facebook didn't put out no misleading information that caused people to vote for Trump. Um, also, I mean, it's been like, what, three years? And still none of this information has been shown. None of this so-called misinformation has come to the forefront. Like, oh, my goodness, they tried to blame RT. RT started doing exposés, documentaries, and specials on them. So they had to leave RT alone. Um they went after, uh, they named a couple of foreign companies and corporations, all of which who sued. They indicted people, all of which were Russians living in Russia. I mean, and now, now that you got Sleepy Joe, and I mean, it gets worse. Sleepy Joe has committed to, um, first they said a black woman. But you know how they do it, right? You know how the Democrats do the whole race hustle thing, right? First, they'll start off as black. Then they'll call you colored people. Then they'll call you people of color. Next thing you know, this Asian chick is getting your benefits. These illegal aliens are getting your benefits. And they're doing it again. They're doing it again. <clears throat> and they're like, he's like, yes, yes. I'll get you a black person. I'll get you a woman of color. Right. Ah, woman of color. Oh. So he's probably going to pick Kamala Harris. And I hope so, man. I hope so. Right. You remember how much fun we were having when she was running for president. And I kept calling her knee pads. You remember all the laughter, all the joy. I hope he does pick her, man. Can you just imagine us laughing over this? Sleepy Joe and Creepy Ho together again, just say no. But anyway, um, their candidate is terrible, man. Joe Biden is the worst candidate since Bob Dole fell off the stage. He has no chance, man. And so they have to bring up the Russians. And that's what this whole Russian thing, and they're, they're running with it like it's real, but it's just ridiculous. This, the, basically what they're saying, the Russians paid the Taliban to kill American soldiers in Afghanistan and Trump didn't do anything about it. What's he going to do about it? They want to make an, an issue out of it. And it's just, it's just made up, man. It's just made up like, like Santa Claus, like the tooth fairy, like it's just made up like almost all of the other lies that the Democrats tell. I mean, and they have to, they have to distract from the fact that their failure to lead in Seattle, their failure to lead in Minnesota, it cost people their lives. It cost people their businesses, their jobs. Um, wow, man. Wow. I mean, you know, then you got, um, Cuomo and a couple of the other Democratic mayors who put the COVID-19 patients in the nursing homes and killed all those old people. 
Then you got the lockdown. They just doubled up on the lockdown. They just doubled up on the lockdown. So we're locked down again. So um, the Democrats, um, they're looking at an uphill battle with Sleepy Joe. There's, there's nobody that's going to vote for Sleepy Joe and Creepy Ho together again. Just say no. Nobody's going to vote for that. I, so anyway, um, no. The Russia thing, it's just the latest version of the Russia hoax. That's my video. I'd like to thank you for watching.